Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for the past week, I've only been using the Genki One textbook to study Japanese, but that's mainly because I'll be taking Japanese 102 this upcoming spring semester, and I haven't taken 101 in about four years, so I really don't want to feel behind once that class starts. But if you want to know how I've been using Genki, then keep on watching. First, I made note cards of all the vocabulary from lessons 1 through 4 in this app called Quizlet. I used to make physical note cards, but I really prefer this way because I can study anywhere since I know I always have my phone on me. I really wanted to make sure that I knew all the vocabulary, and luckily since I studied with this book before, a lot of it came back so it didn't take too long to go through all the words. I like that the first time you see a word, you get a list of options to choose from, and the second time you see those same words, you just type in the translation. It really helped me see if I knew the vocabulary well enough before I moved on. Next time we want to study in grammar. I look over a few grammar points first, then make my own sentences combining some of that grammar. I make my own sentences so that I'm sure to be practicing vocabulary from that lesson and it's just a way to test myself to see if I really understood the grammar. I like to highlight the overall grammar topic and I highlight where I use it in my sentences. Since I'm not currently in a class, I upload all my sentences to this Lang8 website and a native speaker will correct them for free. That way I know for sure what I need to work on. I'll leave a link to that website in the description box below. Even though I end up having to type out my sentences so that they can get corrected, as you all saw, I do prefer writing them out by hand. That way I can get used to the writing system. Once I finish all the grammar, I like to listen to the conversation at the beginning of the lesson to see how much I understand. Then I'll listen to it again and repeat each sentence out loud so that I can practice my speaking skills. So yeah, that's pretty much all I've done this past week. I will make another video showing how I use all of the resources that I bought, but for now, that's all I have. Thanks for watching.